The only time I get in that position is when I give birth. Oh. Ah, my you... back. Are you all right? No, but it's worth it. No pain, no gain. Gotta look good for Dirk. A man his age is used to a trim body with good tone. Oh, then buy him a princess phone. <laughs> And make fun. These treatments are working. Oh, come on, Blanche. Now think about it for a minute. If you feel you have to go through all of this, then what kind of a relationship can this possibly be? A youthful relationship. A relationship that I want. Dorothy, Dirk is the youngest man I've ever dated. If I'm going to keep him, i got to give it all I got. Now, if you'll excuse me, i got some road work to do. Oh, hi, Blanche. You look terrific. Oh, thanks. <laughs> Blanche looks terrible. <laughs> Look at me. I have turned back the hands of time. <laughs> Since Dirk asked me out, I've dropped 10 years. Why, my face is smooth, my body is taut, and my gears are grinding. <laughs> Blanche, no matter what you do to your face, your body, or your gears, you are still your age. Look at me, I used to be a tall, voluptuous blonde with a butt like granite. When Dirk looks at me, you think he sees an old woman? No, he sees a young, vibrant, passionate contemporary. Oh, Blanche, you haven't even been out with him yet. Oh, but my instincts are infallible in this. Believe me, I know men. No arguments here. A husband like Dirk could keep me young another 20 years. I'll kill you. <laughs> You look gorgeous. Oh, well, really? Yeah. Goodness, I didn't even have time to put on my makeup. <laughs> <laughs> Would you mind waiting out in the van, Dirk? I'll be with you in just a minute. Sure. <laughs> I do believe the man said gorgeous. I'm going to live forever. I'm not outside of an institution. <laughs> I believe I will have the escargot and the duck a la range and a nice tossed salad with the blue cheese dressing. I'll have the watercress salad with two lemon wedges, please. Oh, that sounds great. I didn't even see that on my menu. Oh. I I'll have the same thing. Isn't this a lovely place? Mm -hmm. It's one of my favorite restaurants. I'm into macrobiotics myself. I am, too. I just like this atmosphere. Yeah. <laughs> so, what did you do before you got into teaching aerobics? I worked at a museum. You're kidding me. I work at a museum. I love art. Me, too. I love lifting it. I beg your pardon? I used to unload the trucks. And I don't know why, but lifting those statues really helped develop my deltoids. Uh -huh. See? Yes, that's fascinating. Put that down, honey. <laughs> Read any good books lately? Pumping Iron. I saw the movie, too, but I don't think it did the book justice. How could it? I really like being with you. Well, thank you, Doug. I like... The way you sound and the way you look. Well, thank you, Dirk. <laughs> you remind me of my mother. She lives in Seattle, and I haven't seen her for about three years. But when I'm with you, I kind of feel like I'm home with Mom. <laughs> Waiter. 86, the watercress. I'll have the orange duck and the double Jack Daniels on the rocks. 